How to get live data in Excel using Dariscope. Task 1. Get the last traded price of the Microsoft stock. Dariscope works with formulas. Use the Dari Live ribbon to paste the correct formula. Start by selecting the cell where you want the price to appear. You will need this ribbon section that lists the supported providers. Click here and then OK. This is the formula. It takes two arguments, YF and MSFT. YF for Yahoo Finance, MSFT for Microsoft. Task 2. Get the last traded price of several stocks. Select a free cell. Click here. Select this. And then OK. This is the array formula. This is the symbol's input. And this is the field's input. Task 3. Change a field. Select this cell and choose a new field, such as volume. Errors appear due to cells being formatted as dates. Simply click here to refresh the output range. Task 4. Redefine the referenced symbols. Select any cell in the output range. Then click this button and select symbols. Select the column with your new symbols. Click OK. Select the cell where you want to display the output. Click OK. Done. Task 5. Add a field. Copy the cell of an existing field. Paste it to the right. Click to select the new field. Then you need to update the formula to reference the new field. Select any cell in the output range. Then click this button and select fields. Select the row with your new fields. Click OK. Select the cell where you want to display the output. Click OK. Done. Task 6. Get the prices of all stocks in S&P 500. Select a free cell. Click here. Select S&P 500 here. And then OK. Task 7. Get Yahoo prices that are auto-updated every 5 seconds. Delete the previous stuff. Select a free cell. Simply click on the dark Yahoo lamp to turn it on. Feeds are coming every 5 seconds. Upticks shown as green. Downticks shown as red. This is the array formula that displays the feeds on the spreadsheet. Next, get prices from the IEXT provider. Note, now two lamps are glowing. Task 8. Change the IEXT update interval to 1 second. Click this button. Choose engine frequency, and set 1 second here. Next, get FX rates from TFX. Change also the update interval to 1 second. Note, now three lamps are glowing. Let's reduce the duration of each flash. Switch off the TFX engine.
switch off the IEXT engine. Switch back on the IEXT engine. Switch back on the TFX engine. Suppress flashing. Now numbers keep changing without flashing. Let's change the flashing colors. First, format everything as black. Customize the flashing colors by clicking here. Restart flashing. Now, only the foreground color of the cells is flashing. Check out the following videos for more information on Dariscope live feeds.